Hi guys and welcome to yet another episode of our engineering drawing series. Do you want to know how to draw an involute? Please then watch this video to the end because this video is definitely for you. We're going to be using just one dimension to draw an involute. So let's take our radius. Let's take our radius to be 21 millimeter. Okay. So this is our parameter so with this parameter i want to draw an involute all right let's draw now to draw an involute you just need about four instruments your meter rule your set square your compass and your pencil so with this instrument you can draw our involute okay let's start so first things first i would advise to um position your diagram towards the center because it will kind of spread out now, first things first, measure out our radius, which is 21 cm. This is 21. Okay. 21 cm, okay. And then we'll draw a circle towards the center. Okay, so this is our circle. Then we'll mark the center point. And then we'll divide this circle into eight equal parts. Now, we'll draw our horizontal line and then our vertical line. Okay, and then do this. So the next thing I want to do is that from point zero, I'm going to draw a straight line, okay? Very straight line. Let's draw it this. Okay. Now after drawing that straight line, we are going to number the straight line. Now this is how I'm going to draw our numbering. We measure from 0 to 1, okay, 0 to 1, check is the same thing as 7 to 0 to 1, okay, check is the same thing, so, so, let's just get this dimension, okay, and you start at point 0, and then you cut an arc, okay, that I should put the pivot and compass as the pivot. Pivot there again and cut another arm. Now you are making eight different divisions, okay? Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, okay. Seven, okay. Now we are done with our numbering. And that's the first thing that we're going to make use of these, these two instruments. Now, please watch very carefully. Now, this is one, okay? So, at one, you put your ruler this way, okay? Put your ruler this way. And then, with your set square, as it touches one here, okay? You draw a straight line. This line should be very faint, please. This line should be very faint, okay? Now, this is for two. This is two. Two here. Two or two, you put a ruler and then draw a straight faint line. Do the same thing to a tree. A tree, you put a ruler and give it a perpendicular line. Now we want to draw 
our, our locus okay of this involute and this is what we're gonna do measure distance from zero to one that's one to zero okay the same thing okay and then put it at point one without shaking your compass and then mark an at right what an at okay we should measure zero to two okay three to two and then you put it at two and then cut an arc okay on this line okay then the three okay and put that point three and up measure zero to four and from four okay measure zero to five At point eight, okay. Mm -hmm. Copy here now with a nice French curve. We're gonna join all these points together. Remember, this is the point we marked, okay. And then back to here. Okay, so I've joined all the points in my French curve and I've gotten this beautiful okay, you finally learned involute. how to draw an involute now very quickly the next part in engineering curve is what we call an epicycloid if you want to learn how to draw an epicycloid please go to the description part of this video and watch and learn how to draw an epicycloid please subscribe to my youtube channel if you haven't subscribed please smash that subscribe tab below and subscribe to my youtube channel if you learn from this video please like this video and drop a lovely comment all right guys see you guys in the next episode bye for now